I get it. But you have to collect loot before you get to sleep. You have to do your chores, your loot chores, before you get to sleep. of your imagination. Varts. All right. Now I, that trip to the Friendly Arm Inn uh, definitely proved that I am prioritizing the loot in a completely foolish manner. Silver rings are nothing, and really green stone rings are nothing. I gotta pick up studded leather armor and bows and bastard swords before I pick up silver rings, and I think the green stone rings were like five gold pieces, so should pick up the bows before I pick those up anyway. It's nice when it's just gold. That's what we need. We just need gold and obvious loot. I want to pick up everything, of course, yes. but I can't do that, can I? Spit it out. Sort it. What seems like a hundred years ago, we were standing outside this cave, or kind of poked our nose inside the cave, didn't we? I'm on it. And we said that we were going to redo our inventory. Whoa, there's a trap here. Okay. And come back to it. Well, here we are. And our inventories are going to empty out our inventory now. Redo them. Um... And we're kind of ready in case there's loot. Kind of. Now, um, good thief. I want you to disarm. Whoa, what is that? Flesh column. All right, now, uh, Solonar, I need you fall back. I need big bruisers up front. So let's get them up front. And, um, why, right, Buren, what are you doing? Oh, I think he misses Buren. That is Uncle Bell. Uncle Bell, we need a bless. So make that happen right there. Garen, we need. Um, magic missiles. Solinar, you need to... Let's get rid of... Having two arrows in an inventory spot is incredibly irritating. So whatever those are. Acid arrows. Yes, let's use those first. Yeah. What do you want? And you can get off some range missile attacks. I think we need a nymph, maybe, hopefully, on the other side of him so it can attack him from behind. Hopefully... Whoa, he just punched Buren really hard. That must have hurt. Okay. Um, more magic missiles, Garen. And somebody's going to have to heal Buren. Alright, I think everybody's doing what they should. Are you guys. Why are you guys not attacking? 
you, you know, just standing there to get punched is really not what I wanted you to do. But you seem to think it was. Alright, I'm going to have to have Zero fall back now. Um, yeah. And then, oh, we've got a Nymph. Redrissian, heal, Buren. At least we have done a number on this thing. That's good. Uh, less spells sometime soon, Uncle Bell, please. There we go. Now, yes. Uncle Bell, hit it with Call Lightning. And... Who is it probably going to attack next? Who is this? This is... Aaron, Aaron, you need to get off that spell. Oh dear. That was bad. Okay. Um, did we heal Bjorn yet? Could we make that happen sometime today, please? Have you actually get the spell off? Or have the nymph actually get involved? Who is this and what is he doing? This is Uncle Bell, finally. I'm oh, testing that. Oh, lightning, right. Okay, not bad. Bjorn, you're back in a little quicker than I thought you would be. Let's heal you again. Oh, lightning is almost taking longer than a blessed spell. Almost. Alright. I think that was close with Garen, but I think we're good. Now, uh, let's heal up everyone. Grissian, do you have a do? Hit Garen with that Dormini Moon spell. Don't get spell. Your Buren. Or heal. Not poisoned or anything. You don't really have to cure him. Where? Oh my god, there's another one. Okay. Uh, Buren, go ahead, attack. Where is my nymph? Garen, get the heck out of there before you get punched again. Who is this? Doing what? Redrissian. All right. Uncle Bell, give us another call lightning. And Eldorus, get up there. You cannot take me the melee off. Solinar, you are out of acid arrows. What do we want to use? Arrow of ice sounds good to me. What you got for me this time? So you can attack with those. And Garen, we need something incredible to happen here. What would that be? Yeah, you know, it's kind of all out of incredible. Let's just go magic missile, and that will have to do. Um, everybody's doing something meaningful, right? Um, you have got to you don't have any uh, away. Oh, his inventory's full, right? So, so um, drop one of those. We don't care. And take some potions from Eldorus. And then your quick inventory. And, uh, use one of those. Oop, uh, what the heck? I'm gonna do it from here. Ah, that's irritating. Okay, and address him and heal him. Heal points. Uh, heal points. Oh, damn it. Alright, um, I may have to have... You're, in, you're gonna have to run away. Okay. Now you can take a potion. Now I think you're far enough away. Everybody is attacking otherwise, right? Aaron, I don't know why you insist on doing it, but you do. Anytime I don't want you to use spell points, you're using spell points. When I don't want you to rush into melee, you're rushing into melee. Who just got... Eldorus just got hit pretty good there. If... 
spell ever finishes casting that spell, I can have him heal somebody. Right, let's do that again, Darren. And somebody just got punched again or no? Buren is going to drink that potion sometime this year. There we go. All right, Buren, get in on the attack. And Verdrissian, do you have anything? Where's the nymph? The nymph? Full life? There she is right there. Okay. She should be attacking. Bell, you're supposed to heal someone, I think. I think that's what I want you to do. Attack going. Alright. Aaron, you didn't do much with that. Ghost armor. Like that. Might not be a bad idea for you right now. Go ahead and cast that on yourself. Because I think you're going to have to try to take some wax with your quarterstaff. Um, I suppose. Actually, you know what? This is blindness. Let's see if we can blind the flesh golem. Should have thought of that before, shouldn't I have? Um, what are we doing, Rudrissian? Anything of use? Arm, person, or mammal. Would that work on a flesh golem? Dark skin, slow poison. Alright, um, just attack. So we just attack. Realize everybody's doing what maybe they should be doing. Who is getting really beat up? Right, Echo Bell. Pure Eldoris. Alright, nice. Oh, those things are tough. Alright, um, we are going to check their corpses for loot. Of course they have nothing. Of course they don't have anything after they bashed our brains in like that. And we are going to quietly tiptoe out of the cave. We're going to stop walking around like mental cases and fighting one another. And we are going to heal up with spell points I don't think we have. <laughs> and rest up. So let's, let's work on that. We've rested twice. Is that... that Whoa. Well, that's how many... Rests... Uh, rests it took to get us all healed up and all spell pointed. Is there going to be I think we have another corridor down that way or whatever passage, however you want to say it? What was in why is Darren leading the what the heck was that? There must have been a trap there. Why was Garen leading the way? That is the question here. All right, so what's going to have to happen here is, first of all, he's going to have to be healed. Everybody's going to be have, they're going to have to be healed. And I'm going to have to stop charging around like a dunderhead. <laughs> and start acting like there are some traps in this uh, tunnel system. Alright, I think we're all rested and healed up. What I haven't done in a long time is checked leveling, how far off we are. Yeah, everybody's kind of looking pretty far off, aren't they? Garen is the closest, and everybody else is pretty much 10 or 20,000 experience points away from leveling. Sorted. Let me see if I've gotten over my trap mismanagement. Uncle Bell. Let's guess the cheat spell. No sooner said than done. Finding traps and such now, and I don't think there's anything here. Alright. So the rest of the company can come along. I guess I want to... I, I have this feeling that this is just going to wrap around, isn't it? It's just going to reconnect there. I just got that feeling. So, why are we talking to bats? We didn't want to talk to bats. 
And Uncle Bell, are you still? Why are you? Why does it not say you're detecting traps? What? All right. Um, I think. No sooner said than done. We can get you past. No, we can't get you past your comrades. Okay, so everybody. Oh, you right. Everybody so down here. What are those? Little bridges? Are they ladders? I don't even know what those Break are. It quick. I guess. I guess they're little bridges over chasms. Is that what it is? Okay. Oh boy, don't do it. Okay. So we've definitely got a trap. Yeah. What are you, yeah, I'll Let's get right see on. if our thief wants to earn his keep in the party. You're going to disarm that, right? Nicely done. Solonar. Okay. Now, both of you got to get back down here because I have no... What are we dealing with over here? Hello? What is that? There's an island with something in it. And I guess we've got... Can we even get at that? That's weird. All right. Yes. Uncle Bell. Oops. I am screwing no this all up. I want to make oh, sure our bruisers right. get at... You know what I think we're going to do before we even get into this passage? All right. Bjorn, come back down here. Let's get oh. Uncle Bell to take the half an hour to cast the last spell down here. How may I be and Rudrissian to cast the nymph spell. Oh, I should have cast the nymph. Now the nymph isn't blessed. Alright, there we go. We've got ourselves a nymph. The nymph is going to go out in front. Then Bjorn. Then Solinar. As the nymph decides to get across the bridge. Now we shouldn't have... Oh, I knew it. Okay, um... Uranus just, I don't know where, I didn't tell him to charge off like that, but he's doing that. Alright, so yeah, he's in attack mode. Let's just make sure he continues attack mode there. My, where's the nymph? The nymph has, boy, she, she likes to trail behind and screech. That's what she likes to do. Alright, everybody else, uh, Redrissian, what can you... What can you do for him? Yeah, that's not going to work. Spell magic's not going to work. We don't need that right now. Orc skin. I know it. Cast that on yourself. And um, then you will attack. Make it quick. Bell. This is going to take you just as long as a less spell, but so be it. Garen, let's get magic missile a thousand times on it. And these are just bats fluttering around the cave to add to our anxiety. Are we flying in our fla face? In our face, too. Flying in our face when we're trying to strike. Trying to attack. Okay, now. Uh, I would have you take hit points off him when you do this. That's what I would have you do. Ooh, you're in. Okay. Now, you've got Bark Skin already, so I think you've got it already. So go ahead and heal him. And yeah, we're good, I think. Yes, you could. So why don't you fall back? Okay, what did the nymph just cast there? That was interesting. Is he held or something? What does she do to him? Barely injured? All right, we want him... Extremely injured. Uncle Bell, you're not doing anything, so heal Buren as well. Garen, you are not going to attack with that. You think you are, but you are not. I could almost get you around him and have you do a um, scorcher, but yeah, no. Alright, Nymph, what are you doing? I need you need you attacking. Alright, um, who's doing what there? Alright. I think you can be of assistance by casting heal on Eldorus. Otherwise, oh, you know what? You need to be doing something, don't you? Yeah, that would help if my whole party was attacking. Um, why does it seem like things are going terribly awry here? Um, you are casting heal, okay. Everybody's casting heal. Who should be casting heal? Yes. 
Right, Uncle Bell's casting it, or should be casting it on Buren. And Redrissian is casting it on Uncle Doris. Okay. Have to get you to move, Eldoris. Now, see, Garen, this is really just not helpful at all, is it? Let's get you all out of heal. No, you have that heal thingy. Let's get you to do that. Okay, Garen. I what would I have you do? What is this? Um, let's see. Now he has to have like 20 hit points or something like that, right? Ghost armor. Um, hmm. I don't know. Boy, this heal spell is taking forever. You're attacking with bow, right? I don't know where you are. I don't know where anybody is. Where is the nymph? Why did the nymph run away? Okay, let's see what's going on here. Exactly. Alright, Garrett, since you seem... Hell that... Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, I see. You can't get past, so you're doing that. Um, no. Don't... Um, Uncle Bell? Where are you? Redressing's about to die. Boy, this is a bad place to be fighting him, isn't it? Um, Garen, what are you doing? Who is this? This is Eldorus. But you know what? We're going to have to fall back and regroup here. Because we are just getting ridiculous in this um, stupid area. Okay. Now, Nymph. Where is the Nymph? Why don't I see a nymph? Okay, actually, no. You know what? You need to step up and stop him. Uncle Bell, did you ever cure Bjorn or did you just... No, you never cured Bjorn. Healed Bjorn. Okay, now, um... Solonar. Where the heck are you? Solonar. Yeah. What do you want? I need you to stand over here. Oops, nymph is about to... Would you guys just stop running into one another? Please. Okay. Um, Solonar. You need to attack. We lost our nymph. We have... Do you have any... Yes, you do. Let's drink a potion. You should have the bark skin stuff going on. Let's get more magic missiles on it. And Solonar, anytime you want to put an arrow in him, that would be good. I don't know why he had to step up to do the magic missile, Garen, but apparently you did. Alright, um, who just got healed? Did you heal yourself, Redressing? What went on? Oh, you, um... You better attack. Uncle Bell is healing Buren. Eldorus, do you have... You don't have... Let's drink that. And then... Get you to attack. Oh, Garen, really? Okay, who is this? This is Redrissian. This is Eldorus. This is Buren. Yes. The bell, heal him again. It's bless. We don't need bless. We need a heal. And Garen. Now we need a magic missile. What is this again? This is magic missile. Okay. Oh, he's coming after Garen. Garen, you better get out of there. We got him. All right, that was a mess. Uh, mostly because we just do not cooperate in narrow 
tunnels and passageways. That was just an absolute nightmare. All right, and once again, he's not going to... Oh, wait a second. Oh, that's the sword we dropped before. Yeah. Golems. Flesh golems. I guess there's... They don't really have pockets to put anything in, so... I guess that's why that's the case. All right, we're going to uh, heal up, and I think we're going to have to rest up as well. Oh, boy. All right, Karen. You, I would have you get away from that thing. Oh, really? You have to choose the worst way to get away from it. Can you choose a better way to get away from it? You have one magic missile. We need to use that. Somebody's held because, of course, they are. Aaron, you have, like, nine hit points left. Don't do it. Aaron, just let them take care of it. Thank you. All right, who is held <laughs> <laughs> All right, maybe sleeping in the tunnel wasn't a, such a brilliant idea, was it? Darren is now going to stand over his fallen foe victorious. Because, of course, he is. All right, so now I have to wait for the hold. I think that's a hold. To vanish. I don't think. Will Bjorn be able to... Uh, anyway. Gotta rest up and heal up. That's the order of business now. A simple task. All rested up and healed up, I think. Alright, so what we're not gonna do, guys, is we're not gonna have Garen lead the way. We're gonna have the proper party members leading the way. And we're also going to hope that this island over here is where the flesh golems... Ooh, you know what? We could have... We better... Yeah? What do you want? Um, I want you... to detect traps here, first of all. Where are you at? Alright, um, let's let everybody complete their marching orders. Um... Whoa! What the heck? What happened here? We've got... Way ahead of you, boss. So, he went around. Uncle Bell went around. <laughs> he just couldn't follow everybody else. He had to go around and trigger a trap that charmed him. And apparently charmed him... Dire charm. Okay. Yeah. Charm him against us. Alright, Garen. Would you have me do? I would have you unfortunately waste a It's not you. Didn't didn't you have charm? I thought you had charm. No, you only had sleep. Okay, so How may I be of assistance? Looks like it's going to have to be Rudrissian, and he's going to have to dispel magic here. And that would be that one there. Let's see if that... Did he not... No. What just happened there? Redrissian. Oh no, he's... he's. Why is he not... What the heck? What happened there? What is it this time? I need you to dispel magic. Although, Uncle Bell is just kind of hanging out there, so... Maybe never mind. Um, is it just because he doesn't see us and he's, or is he held and charmed? I don't know. <laughs> All right. Well, I have to wait for him to wake up or be uncharmed before, because as soon as I walk over here, I think we're going to be in his, um, line of vision and he's going to attack if that's what he feels like doing with this damn effect on him. All right. So we're going to wait. We're going to wait for him to come back to us. What? No sooner said than like done. Uncle Bell has come back to us. All right. Now, what I would like, what I was trying to do before Uncle Bell showed up as an enemy was have our thief check for traps, but I don't think any of us can. All right, Uncle yeah, Bell. I'll get right on that. Get right on what? 
You're checking for traps on um, Uncle Bell. That's a great idea. Okay, Uncle Bell. Make it quick. Let's get you. Find traps. Right. No sooner said than done. Now, you went through a trap over here, I would assume. But you're not. I guess you triggered it and it's gone. Okay, that's fine. Just want to make sure. There are no traps. Okay, so. You rang. Can we just open up with. Whoa! Oh, I thought that that's him. All right, so that's a lot of gold. That's a lot of treasure. All right, uh, Garen. My wish is for you. Okay, Buren. I know you like treasure and everything, but it's it's Garen's turn. Does he not? He doesn't have any. Okay, let's um, Solinar and. Let's... I don't... Oh boy, I am all out of inventory rooms. Okay. Um, we gotta discard... Why is it that I can't... Oh, it's telling me who can use what. It's not telling me inventory, right? I always get that confused. I want you to get the two unidentified things. Actually, there's a few unidentified things. Very good. Um... Let's go ahead and identify things. Wands are one and a quarter foot long and slender. <laughs> yeah, that sounds, that sounds like an apt description for wands. They are made of ivory, bone, or wood and are usually tipped with something. Metal, crystal, stone, and so on. They are fragile, tend to break easily. Because of this, they are often kept in cases. Wands are powered by charges. Each Use costing one or more charges, depending on the item. When a wand runs out of charges, it is consumed and destroyed. Okay, well, first, let's... let's wand of Paralyzation. That could come in... Oh, you know what? Let me read that. Stun target. Range 100 foot. Okay, so it's a target. That's good. We will definitely hold on to that. Now, nobody else but Garen can use it. That's unfortunate. Dart of Wounding. Now, do you have... I think you have other darts of wounding, which is nice. Cloak. Let's see what the cloak is. Relair's Mistake. Cloak of the Wolf. Relair's Mistake. A great amount of irony... irony surrounds the creation of this magical cloak. Relair was a mage who overestimated the amount of control he had over magic. And in the course of creating this garment, he apparently inflicted lycanthropy upon himself. The wearer can change form whenever he wishes. Relair was not so lucky. Okay, you can turn into... Now, not usable by a wizard slayer. Do I have a party member who might want to turn into a wolf? Of all of us, it would probably be Rodrician. Now, here's the thing. Would Rodrician will be able to use it, but will he can I equip it? I can equip it. Alright, so now our druid can turn into a wolf when he wants. And that way he can defeat the entirety of the rest of the party because we have so much trouble with wolves. Hurry okay, up. now um Aaron, I right, think there right. is there's a manual. The manual on how to build a boat to get across to the island. I think that's what that manual is. Let's um, identify this with a spell. Manual of bodily health. Typical manual of bodily health provides the reader with valuable information regarding preventative medicine, basic first aid, and proper muscle toning. And if this isn't enough, the manual also magically enhanced, thereby a is also magically enhanced, thereby allowing an individual to res raise his or her con boy, raise his or her constitution by a single point. Unfortunately, the manual will disappear after a single use. Constitution raised by one point permanently. Special the book is consumed upon usage. Place it into quick item slot. Now, I'm wondering. 
I am wondering if the see we've we've got so many damn books. Or we did. Yeah, we've got a ton of books, and none of these got us back into candle keep. Are the uh, stewards, the gatekeepers at Candlekeep looking for something that more like this, which, you know, raises attribute points. Is that what they're looking for? It would be nice. It would certainly be nice to raise party member constitutions. But is it more valuable to us to get back into Candlekeep? I don't know. See, here's the disappointing thing. I would hate to get back into Candlekeep Please. only to find out that it didn't do us much good. I, Mike, see, here's, I am incurably curious. I have to know if there's anything in Candlekeep that would interest us at this point. So, with that being the case, Let's get the rest of the stuff. Who yes. has... I no think... sooner said than done. Uh, Garrett, you Hurry have to up. step out of the way. So Uncle Bell can do the no thing. Said than done. Elixir of Health. Oops, did I... Did you pick that up? No, you don't have any room to pick it up. So why am I asking you to do it? Yes. Not entirely sure. What you got for me this time? Uncle what? Bell, step aside. No Seems to be done. the only place that anybody can get at this island, so... Yeah? What are you way ahead of you, boss? So health. What was that? That was potion of absorption. We have potion of infravision and antidote. Somebody has. Yeah, it's antidote. So, um, you're in. Let's get Solonar out of the way since that's the huh? way ahead of you, one boss. island spot anybody can step Salted. up to. Let's have you pick up the antidote and hopefully I can load it. I suppose there is going to be a limit to the number of things that goes go into one slot, but go off then. Um, let's see what Solve. else is here. This is potion of improvision. I feel like somebody else has a potion of improvision somewhere. I do, I do. Maybe it's a scroll of improvision. So health. This potion of genius got some heal potions. Was it Garen? Oh, Garen's got heal potions. All right. Um, the last person who would need it would be Eldorus because he already has Improvision. Yeah, no. All right, so nobody has Improvision. Let's just give that. Oh, Everybody's inventory is full. Wow. Let's give it to uh, Redrissian. Now, this is probably a foolish right. thing to do, but I am going to journey back to Candlekeep and see if that book... I don't, have, I don't have anything else there, right? See if that book buys us passage back into Candlekeep. Uh-oh. Uh, one of these damn things. Okay, um, I would like to kill it before it gets to us, and actually, Solinar, you're going to switch back to regular arrows, you're not going to waste those arrows on it, I would like to kill it before it gets to us, for hopefully obvious reasons, so that it doesn't hold us, mostly, for anybody who hasn't been paying attention, that's what they seem to do to us. All right, Uncle Bell, you are using your ranged weapon. Garen, you have already done the magic missile thing. You might as well do that again, Garen. You might as well. Okay. Yeah, nicely done, everyone. We use game 420 experience points. That is wonderful. And we will continue on to Candlekeep. Well, here we are. Let's see. Yeah, we're we're tired, but 
Let's step up here. Let's have Garen talk to the ward or warden or gatekeeper or whoever he is. Hold travelers before you before you will be allowed entrance you must donate a tome of great value to our libraries. Okay, so that's unfortunate. So we don't have a book, but I used to live here. Yeah, no, that's not going to do us much good. I'm sorry, friend. You know what? So did I I must have tried. Who has the actual Rudrissian has the most tomes. I must have tried this, right? I must have had Rudrissian talk to the gatekeeper. Yeah, I know. Alright, so what what the heck kind of tomes of great value are they looking for? If, if Garen's... Alright, well, you know what? I'm going to improve... Whoops. I'm going to improve Garen's constitution. And, um... Now, did he... Is it a double click? How do I actually... Alright, do I have to do it? Oh, no, he's... Okay, he's... He's reading it. It's... There you go. Alright, so now he should have... Yeah, his constitution was 12, now it's 13. I like that. And I still... I, I have no clue what kind of books we need to get back into... Uh, but, let's... um figure out where we're headed next because I believe I believe we have explored Sea Watcher all we can um, we have this unexplored territory and this unexplored territory so I imagine we try to head here and see what's there you have been by enemies Whoa. And must defend polar bear now, I just rested. Why are you guys... Why is Garen tired again? Alright, well... You guys gotta fight. You gotta fight a polar bear before you can sleep. Apparently we headed to the north. Why is... Not the entire... Do we... Is this... This is a friendly polar bear. I'm trying to kill... A nice, friendly polar bear. Well, you know, in my defense... I've never heard of a friendly polar bear. But apparently we found the one. Now he wants to join our party. Seems like. Alright, new territory. And even though I rested recently, I guess it was a long journey. That journey from Candlekeep to there is it's pretty far. And I guess we had to go all the way around that way, so sort of understandable, right? Neville. Ah, weary travelers. Well met. Neville, the fairest of all fair bandits at your service. What may I do for you this hour? Not steal anything anything from us? Not hostile yet. Well, for starters, you could tell your men in the bushes to drop their bows and step out in the open. Yeah, that... Would be good. Perhaps you could escort us through the, your territory and ensure that we meet with no harm along the way. You could give us all of your money and then let us kill you one by one. Right, no. Um, let's... Let's, uh... Not be ambushed. Did you find all five of them then? Pity. I shall have to train them better. Anyhow, I'm afraid that I can't abide your wishes. My men would think me a coward to surrender in the face of such a paltry force. Truly, I see no other choice than to order them to fire at will and rob your sad corpses of any iron they may carry. Come, men, I believe the choice before us is clear. Okay. Oh, we've got hobgoblins as, um... I thought they were going to be spread out, like, hiding in one big clump there. Anyway. All right, so... Garen, um, what I want you to do... Is I want you to stand over here. Actually, let's just make sure everybody's attacking first of all. Hurry up. Now you can go over there. Uh, 
Eldora, so you're going to attack with your axe. And for Drissian, you are going to give us a nymph. And Uncle Bell. You know what? We're going to skip the bless, and you're going to call lightning on our good friend Neville. Okay, let's see how this goes. And Solnar is attacking. All right. Garen, I would have you Scorcher, good friend Neville. Oh, can't do. Oh, okay. So Neville's gone. Um, let's start taking out the archers over here. I think Eldorus got hit by the. Uh, <laughs> Is he still casting? Yes, he is. He's still casting that. Yes. Okay. Uncle Bell, you know what you better do? You better just attack with melee with everybody else. A waste of my talents. No, that's not what I wanted you to do. There we go. Okay, so now we're good. I think. And Garen, actually, you could... No, you can't now. Uh, never mind. Uh, oops. Uh, did we... Yeah, I see. Okay. Um, we didn't get off the spell, did we? Who is... Who is this? This is Uncle Bell. Uncle Bell, you can heal him. Didn't get off the nymph spell, but I don't think we're going to need it necessarily. Um, but we do need to ensure that Rudrissian doesn't die. Okay, Garen, what are you doing? Garen is... Is Garen... Garen casting heal? Am I... Losing my mind here? He must have done that with a... Potion? Or a scroll? <laughs> that was different. Alright, um... Well, that was pretty exciting. I haven't seen Garen do that before. Interesting. Alright, uh, Redrissian, heal yourself again. And everybody... Huh? Nope, Solonar is not attacking. Solonar, you need you to, to attack. Nice and done. Garen, do that again. On, hopefully, the last guy. Redrissian, you might as well heal yourself. With the big heal there. Okay, that's all of them. Everybody's healed. We're definitely going to need to rest, but let's um, let's search you Neville first. Okay, he's got a good amount of gold. Chainmail. Chainmail. Does anybody need chainmail? In my company, I don't know. Um, Uncle Bell. Yes. You need to heal Eldorus. Got Nick there. Alright, um inventory room. We can have Bjorn because that chainmail is going to be very heavy. So Bjorn. Let's um No, is this not we need to get Rudrissian out of the way. You rang. Sorted. Okay. Need you to see if you can pick up the chainmail. Dispel magic. Karen, do you have a dispel dispel magic scroll? Reese. Hands. Does anybody have spell magic? Tech illusion. Okay, remove magic, detect evil, hmm, detect invisibility, doesn't look like it, doesn't look like I have any dispel magic scrolls. You're going to pick that up. Actually, um, let's... Garen's the only one that can use it, so let's give it to him. But he needs to 
bandit scalp. I think I'm done with the bandit scalps. Actually, well, can we do, can we double up? We can double up bandit scalps. So let's do that. Garen, um, Your wish? you need to give, you need to give, I'll kill to somebody. You can put this I think, in your quick inventory. And then you're not close what enough to pick do? anything up. That's well. different. Now, let's see if you can. Garen's got to get off I'm on it. the corpse. Otherwise, Garen can't pick up the sword he needs to identify. If you insist. I insist. Yeah. Shut things around a little bit here. Identify. Longsword. Longsword plus one. Now we have a two handed sword plus one that Bjorn is using. All right. So there we go. We can give that to Aldorus. And he will now have, rather than a regular longsword, he will have a longsword plus one as a choice for a weapon. He's also got Eshadina. I think the damage on this is better. I think. Yeah, there's some electrical damage there. Don't know though. It's it's pretty close. But anyway, he's got a nice backup sword there. We really, really, really need to get Redrissian something. Your wish? Something better than what he's been using. Um all right, now uh the entire party right, what's this then? Let's get over here by the hobgoblins and see what the heck they have. They have got oddly enough, ocean of fortitude what can Eldorus, pick up Ocean of Fortitude. He can. And let's get our party members me time? to load up on their arrows that they've been using. No gold? No gold in these guys? Oh yeah, we got a little bit of gold. Alright, very good. So, we'll get the... We will get the inventory sorted. And, uh, yeah. Spit it out. And we gotta rest up and heal up. Alright, I think we're all healed up and rested up. And we've got severe inventory issues that we need to take care of. So, that's gonna require another trip what is it this time? to what, the Friendly Arm Inn. Which means a lot of traveling and a lot of resting. So, Hurry up. we're gonna get on that. Winter Wolf. We haven't seen these before. That's something new we can fill. Whoa, Winter Wolf just did something weird. Did it just spit some kind of cold spell at us? Is that what that was? That was different. Alright. Well, took care of it. Not without getting banged up a little bit, though. So let's get Redrissian to heal himself. How come we got attacked by the polar or by the winter wolf, but not the polar bear? Different. Aren't they kind of from the same region of the world? And and is it becoming winter, and I'm just not aware of it? Is there a season change that I'm uh, unfamiliar with going on here? <laughs> 